Hello and welcome. Uh, I'm Nitesh Pran from LabVIEW and Multisim. In this video, I will show you how can we record and acquire our voice data using LabVIEW. If you are using laptop, so you can easily store, record and display your voice, your sound. Okay, so let's start the programming. So for that, you have to right click on the block diagram and in the block diagram in the second column you will get the sound and graphics in this sound and graphics in this sound and graphics the second column second row sorry second row for second one you will get a sound in this sound you need input okay now let's come here acquire take this acquire and place it into the block diagram and now i uh, i want to use uh, my computer's microphone and two channel because I want to get the full stereo data. So that's why I will acquire the data with two channel and resolutions here. I kept this uh, resolution is 16 bit resolutions. Okay. And I want to acquire the data for five seconds. Let's okay. Now right click come here and take away from graph. After that, take away from graph and make a connection like this. Now you can see you can easily acquire the data for five seconds. Okay. Now when I will run the program, so it will. Uh, so uh, when I will run the program, so VI will run for five seconds and it will display each and every data each and every voice as for my okay whatever i will speak it will record so now hello myself Mitesh me Pradhan. i am trying to teach lab view okay now you can see it is my voice suppose okay 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 now you can see here okay i am getting if i will run okay Now you can see here, we are easily able to acquire this data. We are easily able to record, uh, sorry, acquire the data and display. Now here, uh, let's try to generate the data. Let's try to generate the data. So for that, I will use a flat sequence first. In this flat sequence, our system will acquire the data. In the second frame, system will wait for two seconds only okay wait system will wait for two second so that's a three second 300 3000 millisecond system will wait and in the third one in the third frame it will my system will repeat what okay my recorded data so now come to the graphics come into the sound come into the output and play waveform here uh, everything is set a resolution is this one a uh, channel is, is this one okay let's try to connect hello sir my name is Nitesh Pradhan here I am trying to teach the lab view Hello, sir. My name is Nitesh Pradhan. Here I am trying to teach the lab view. Okay. Uh, in my recording, uh, in my recording, my voice, uh, I has closed the system record. Okay, just a second. Give me a moment. System, uh, I am going to open the system audio. Now, again, I am going to run the program. So, because uh, I had uh, opened the system audio recording so you will get the proper data proper information hello myself me hello myself me this Pradhan I am a lab view programmer so now in this way you can easily acquire display and uh, acquire display and generate your sound okay so in the next video, I will show you how can we store the real time voice. Okay. 
in the wav format using our uh, using lab view that i will show you 